I'm going to show you how to take your snow glide machine and set it from side edge setup into base bevel mode. The first thing you need to do, and very important, is disconnect your power. It's very easy to hit the power switch while you're making the switch over from side edge to base edge setup. First step is you want to take the large screw with the black top on it on the left hand side of the machine and unscrew that completely. You don't need to remove it, but it needs to be completely disconnected from the housing. Then you fold the machine from the upper trays and the lower trays to 90 degrees. So you see you have the lower tray and the two upper trays at 90 degrees. Reinsert the large screw with the black knob on the left side of the machine. And make sure you get that nice and snug. Now you basically have it set up, but what you need to do is in order for it to operate in the base bevel mode, it's very important the machine works on its own pressure and springs. There's a spring inside of the machine here that's connected to this large black screw on the top of the upper trays. You need to increase the spring tension and remove the stopper which stops the tray from completely going down. If you don't do this step, you will not be able to run the machine in the base bevel mode. So, the spring is connected to this black screw. As you can see, as I pull that up, there's spring tension there. Pull the stopper out. The screw will stay up. This means you have correct spring tension now to do your base bevel guide. You have two rollers on the large rails and those are going to sit directly on the ski and you're going to put these small rollers up against the edge with some light pressure. With your right hand you're going to hold the machine flat on the ski itself. The ski is in the vices as if you're waxing as you can see. Now a very important step is you need to set the cutting depth of the diamond. As you can see here if I drop down, I'm cutting a lot of base, which I don't want to cut base, I only want to cut, cut the base edge. Where you set that adjustment is actually on the right hand side of the machine, the other large black knob with a locking knob. This is connected to this post, which is connected to the bearing against the edge. By turning this, I move the machine inside or outside. And as you look down from the top view, I can adjust that slowly and get just the amount of edge that I want. You want the entire width of the edge plus a very small portion of the base edge. Once you've got that set, on this side there's the back piece. You want to make sure that you lock that you lock the locking piece against itself. That'll keep maintain your, your depth of cut evenly. So now you're basically ready to run the machine, except for you want to make sure that you set your base bevel edge that you want. Here it's set at 89.5, that's a half a degree of base bevel. If I go to 89.0, that's one degree of base bevel. If I go back to 90, it would be actually totally flat. So now you're ready to run the machine.